We are in your presence. Fill us with your power. Live inside of me. Welcome, Holy Spirit. Welcome, Holy Spirit. We are in your presence. Fill us with your power. The living water. You're the living water, ever dying fountain. Come to dwell and come to love. Take up the control. Welcome, Holy Spirit. We are in your presence. Fill us with your fire. Well, hallelujah, the Lord God Almighty, he reigns. Oh, you, Amen. Amen. Hallelujah, the Lord God Almighty reigns. Hallelujah, the Lord God Almighty reigns. Let's rejoice. Yeah. 
are his name. Praise the name of the Lord. For God is good and he's worthy to be praised. Amen. The song says, Thou art worthy. Gracious and our eternal God, Lord, we thank you for this privilege, Lord, that we can come in your house, Lord Jesus. As the Psalms of David said, I was glad when they said unto me, Let us go into the house of the Lord. We thank you, O God, for this place where we can come to fellowship, to worship, to call on the name of Jesus. For there is no name that given among mankind where we must be saved, but in the name of Jesus. There is comfort in the name of Jesus. There is peace in the name of Jesus. There is joy in the name of Jesus. There is forgiveness in the name of Jesus. There is healing in the name of Jesus. 
we thank you this morning, Lord. Oh, we can celebrate our bishop and co-pastor. Lord, we can join with them, Lord, to celebrate, Lord, the birthday and the anniversary, Lord. Lord, you have spared their life. You have given them another year, oh God, to rejoice, Lord, than to know that there is a greater is yet to come. We thank you, for oh, you are almighty God. Lord, you are merciful, you are kind. Lord, your mercy, you are new every morning. And great is your faithfulness to us. Lord, bless this day, Lord. Bless each one that come, Lord God, under this roof, O oh God, to lift up your name. Even those that come in, Lord, we thank you for your faithfulness, Lord. For you are faithful, Lord. Lord, even, Lord, when we unfaithful, sometimes you're still faithful. Lord, we messed up many times, but Lord, you don't kick us to the curb. You still love us, Lord. That's the God that we serve. Lord, you're loving and you're kind, Lord. As a father to his children, Lord. And we wait patient on you this morning, oh God. You come and bless us, Lord. You come and turn our mourning, Lord, into songs of joy and praise, Lord. He said, weeping may endure for a night, but joy will come in the morning. And those that sow in tears, Lord, shall reap in joy. Oh, we thank you, Lord. Thank you. Even those that sow towards your people this morning, that they will not go without, Lord. They will not go empty, but God, you will refill them, Lord. You will provide, you will open door, you will make a way, you will bless them with peace and comfort, Lord. We thank you, Lord. Bless our bishop and co-pastor. Strengthen them this day, oh God, and every day, Lord. They are a light in this community wherever they go. They shine for you, Lord. We pray you will strengthen them. Every way this morning, each one, Lord. Bless the work of your end. We give you the honor, the glory, and the praise. And we wait at your footstool and we tell her thanks. In Jesus' precious name, we pray. Amen. Amen. Praise, Praise God. I'd like for you to pray for the Lord to remain standing at this time as we're going to introduce to you this morning the Bishop Franklin Hobbs and Pastor Carolyn Hobbs of Rehoboth Lighthouse Full Gospel Church. Amen. 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 We're celebrating him this day. Praise the Lord. We're celebrating the man and woman of God today. Yeah. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord, faithful workers of God, amen. We bless you today, hallelujah. We honor you this day, praise the Lord. As they come in, this is the month of June that we're blessed we're, we're going to celebrate with the bishop and uh, with our pastor, uh, three days of celebration. But I just want to let you know that they've had 53 years wedding anniversaries, which was June 17th, amen. 53 years, God has blessed them. It's um, 77 years birthday celebration for our bishop, June 20th. Amen? Yeah. Praise the Lord. God has kept him here strong. Amen. Full of life for 77 years. 53 years of pastor pastoral, it says. And 30 years since bishop was called here to Haverhill. Praise the Lord. Yeah. And we are glad. Amen. Yeah. Praise God. God has truly blessed us with a wonderful man and woman of God. And I know that you uh, feel your, the love for them each and every day, not today, but it's good. The Bible says that we should take time out for the, for the men and the women of God that, you know, that are in service to God. And so today we're going to honor you, Bishop, and uh, we thank you, Mom. We thank you so much for being our spiritual yeah. mom and dad. Amen. Amen. It is. It is so wonderful, and I'm going to let you say it, to have someone that will shepherd over you. They're under shepherds because Jesus is the shepherd, and they're under shepherds, and we can trust them, and they love us, love us enough not to let us stay in any stuff. Love us when we hurt. Love us when we're bad. Love us when we're sad. Love us when we're happy. Amen. Amen. I'm serious, guys. It's an awesome, Amen. awesome responsibility. The love of the Lord has to be in you 
for you to be able to do that. Amen? And we're all strivers to that. I have his love. I am his child. And I have a mom and dad still left in the world that I can go to yeah. at any time. But I want to bless them, and I want to upgird them, and I want to be an encouragement to them as they love me and feed me in the word of God. And I pray that you all will yeah. want to do that too. Amen? Yeah. Amen. So we're going to give our kind words, and we're going to give our flowers while we yet live. Amen? And proclaim God's goodness. But at this time, I'm going to ask, uh, I'm going to ask uh, Elder Annette, would you, Sister Annette, would you come and uh, read the scripture for us? We're going to go, and you maybe uh, stand, stand if you stand for the reading of God's word. Amen? Yeah. And we're going to have celebration today. Amen? So put your happy face on. And let's go and give God some glory as we celebrate this beautiful day. Shall we praise the Lord? Shall we praise the Lord? Indeed, God is a wonderful God. My scripture reading will be taken from Isaiah chapter 10. Reading from verse 1 through 10. Woe to them that decree unto righteousness. Decree that right grievousness which they have prescribed. To turn aside the needy from the judgment. And lo, and to take away the right from the poor of my people. The widow may be their prey, that they may rob the fatherless. And what will he do in the day of visitation, and in the desolation which shall come from far? To whom he will flee for help, and where will he leave your glory? Without me, they shall bow down under the prisoners, and they shall fall under the slain. For all this his anger is not turned away, but his hands is stretched out still. O Assyrian, the rob of mine anger and the staff of their hand is my indignation. I will send him against the hypocritical nation and against the people of my rod will I give him a charge to take the spoil and to take the prey and to tread them down like mire of the street. How be it he meaneth not so, neither does his heart think so, but it is in his heart to destroy and to cut off the nation, not a few. For he said, Are not my princess altogether king? Is not Kalodas, Karomishis, and Comas, his Heman Apat, is not the Syrima, the Samarias, Damascus? As, as my hand had found the kingdom of the idols and those who graven image and expelled them of Jerusalem and of Samaria, here ended a portion of God's holy world. God bless him. Thanks be to God. Praise the Lord. Amen. You may be seated. Praise the Lord. Amen. Praise God. At this time, we're going to have visitors. Uh, and we're going to have the welcoming by me. Praise the Lord. Because uh, Ellen Devin Cunningham, he had to go somewhere. So I say welcome, welcome, welcome today to Rehoboth. Full Gospel Lighthouse Church. Amen. Amen. Do we have any first-time visitors today? Praise God. Stand and give your name. Praise the Lord. Bless you. God bless you. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Welcome. Praise the Lord. Welcome. 
please feel welcome to participate in the part of the service. And you're only a visitor here once. Once you're here, you're not a visitor anymore. Your family, praise the Lord. Oh, we have someone else. Yes, excuse me. Your best friend, what's her name? Uh, yeah. Evelyn, pray, praise God. Welcome. All right, someone go and, and meet and greet you. Thank God that we have people that come from all over and abroad. Please feel welcome in today's service. You are always welcome to be here and be a part of what's going on in God's house. Amen? Amen. Well, we, I don't have any announcements for today, but I will tell you what we're busy about in Rehoboth. Um, Sunday mornings, 9 o'clock, we have adult Sunday school by our capable teacher, Elder James Mackey. 10 o'clock a.m. is morning worship service. We give glory and honor and praise to God. Amen. 10, 6 p.m., we have an hour of power where people can come and give your testimonies and tell of the goodness of where God has brought you to. Amen. And we have a wonderful time. Mondays at 10 o'clock, we have the women are in prayer, lifting up uh, the name of Jesus as they bring their petitions before the Lord. 7 o'clock on Monday p.m., we have intercessory prayer. Tuesday, 7 o'clock, the women gather uh, 7 p.m., the women gather together for prayer. Thursday, 7 p.m., we have Bible study. We have choir rehearsal immediately after 8 o'clock. Friday at 7 p.m., they have the team Bible study, ages 13 and up. And Saturday, 11 a.m. to 3 p.m., we have the youth group every other Saturdays, ages 3 through 12. Saturday, 7 p.m., the men's prayer. And that's every last Saturday of the month. They have a men's meeting. They're, we're busy here. Many things that are not even on this program. They were about um, our Father's business and supporting the community and fellowshipping together. That's what it's all about. It's all about God's kingdom. Amen. So avail yourself to any and all of these if you would. Praise God. And every Sunday morning, right back here, 10 o'clock, we're in the house of the Lord, giving him glory and praise. At this time, we are going to call the women's choir. They're going to come, and they're going to do a song today, uh, Bishop, for you. Praise, praise the Lord. Come, ladies. Come, ladies. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord, ladies. Amen. We want to uh, want to bless Bishop this morning. I know. Come on, ladies. Praise the Lord. That's right. Amen. Okay. All right. 